Hello and welcome to TSC. I'm James Marchington. This is our weekly Tuesday roundup of shooting news. If you're new here, check out our other videos. We also post a video every Thursday with tips and advice to help you improve your shooting. Our latest series is proving very popular. It features David Florent from the Oxford Gun Company demonstrating how to shoot various sporting targets, both singly and as a non-report pair. Last week he was shooting a rabbit clay, followed by a crosser. So if you haven't seen it, go back and watch that one. And hit the subscribe button to keep up to speed with the rest of the series. We'll have another one out this Thursday. So what's in the news this week? Well, Ely have launched two new top of the range clay cartridges. We've got a report from last week's TSC series shoot. And we're announcing two major new sponsorships from the Bentley dealers HR Owen and clothing manufacturers Alan Payne. All that coming up after this. Ely have launched two new clay cartridges, the Titanium and Titanium Strike. They're billed as the fastest and hardest hitting clay cartridges in the Ely range, using PSB Plus powders and A-type plastic wads to deliver dense patterns and impressive breaks with reduced recoil. The Titanium Strike has nickel-coated 7.5 shot, which is hardened for extra braking power. It comes in 28 grams or 24 gram loads. The titanium has 28 grams of 7.5 or 8 shot with plastic or fiber wads. The new shells will be the flagship of Ely's clay shooting range with a price to match. The cost per thousand is likely to be between £300 and £330. They should be available in the shops very soon. Find out more at the Ely website, elyhawklimited.com. Last week saw dozens of young shots descend on the Oxford Gun Company for the latest shoot in the 2018 TSC series. It was a 50 bird sporting shoot for under 21s, and as part of the TSC series, it counts towards qualification for the grand final in December, with two MG cars up for grabs, thanks to sponsors Lodge Hill Garage Abingdon. There was a strong turnout, even though for a lot of young shots, the date clashed with exams. The standard of shooting was impressive, with a high proportion of scores in the 40s. High gun was Harry Lovett with 47. In second place, just one target behind him, was Josh Smith. Top female shooter was Izzy Walters, who beat Naomi Chapman into second place in a shoot-off. There were also shoot-offs to decide the final places for the TSC April competition. Overall winner there was Harry Lovett again. I'm 18, I'm from Hartbury College. Uh, I've done shooting all my life, basically, and we have a shooting ground just down, just 10 miles from Cheltenham, which is where I've learned to shoot, but really. I shot 45 on my first go, and then shot it again and shot 40, 49. So, I'm pretty happy with that. And ladies' winner of the April TSC was Olivia Lowe. I shot it about three, four times, because it was good practice as well. Okay. And how did you get on with those uh, yeah, I seemed to be stuck on 47. I couldn't get higher than 47. But I just miss stupid targets, but yeah. Were you missing the same ones over and over? Oh uh, yeah, the same ones. Same ones. Which one was giving you trouble? It was just the MIDI, the tiny MIDI that came up and some other ones, but that was it. Must have hit some of them. Yeah, and I hit most of them. <laughs> but it was enough to, uh, to win the, the trap out there. Yeah. Fantastic. Well done. The TSC series takes a break now for the summer, but it's back later in the year with the winter series, leading up to the grand final. There's exciting developments at TSC, with two major new sponsors announced this week. First off, it's Bentley dealers HR Owen, who are supporting TSC and the Oxford Gun Company. You'll be seeing more of them on this channel, plus they'll be showing off their range at the Oxford Festival of Shooting in September, including the amazing luxury SUV, the Bentayga. The other new sponsor is Alan Payne, who 
were well known in the shooting world for their country clothing, including tweeds, fleeces and knitwear. They're behind a brand new course, the Game Bird Challenge, which runs throughout July at the Oxford Gun Company. It's a sequence of 100 game-themed clays, including driven targets, a new walk-up and a grass butt stand. There are prizes of Alan Payne clothing in all the categories, including cybersides and small balls, as well as ladies and parent and child. It promises to be great fun, as well as a brilliant way to sharpen up your skills ahead of the game season, which is now less than 12 weeks away. To find out more, check out oxfordguncompany.co.uk and follow them on Facebook. Now, here's our pick of the latest shooting videos on YouTube. This one's a segment from the BBC show Love in the Countryside. The three blokes end up shooting off to see who'll go on a date with Heather the Vet. If nothing else, it's nice to see the BBC showing shooting in a good light for once. To watch it, click on the link in the description below. Well, that's it for this week's news. Thanks for watching. Don't forget there's loads coming up at the Oxford Gun Company over the coming weeks, not just the July Game Bird Challenge we mentioned earlier. June is Air Gun Month, with a competition to win two top-of-the-range BSA air rifles, each worth £900. Then if you're aged between 12 and 21, there are Young Shots Instruction Days, every Tuesday throughout August. And coming up in September, we've got the Oxford Festival of Shooting, which is going to be a great day out for all the family, with demonstrations, have-a-go stands and loads more. Plus, of course, the shop and ground are open as always for practice and tuition, or if you just need to buy a new pair of boots or stock up on cartridges. Check out the website for opening times and details. It's at oxfordguncompany.co.uk. We're back on Thursday with the next in our series on sporting targets, so make sure to tune in again and watch that one. Hit the subscribe button to keep up to date. And do please support our sponsors when you're shopping for guns, cartridges, accessories, clothing or anything else. They're supporting shooting and they deserve our support in return. See you Thursday. <laughs>